This is video we haven't seen before. It was posted on YouTube and it appears to show what the Iranian government has continued to deny during the post-election protest. The sometimes graphic video shows plainclothes security personnel and uniformed security personnel forcing their way onto the campus of Tehran University and beating and arresting and shouting profanities at young men. A couple of things stand out here. The video is dated June 15, which is three days after the disputed vote more than eight months ago. The video was also apparently shot by security personnel themselves, not by protesters. Obviously, these are the types of images the Iranian government does not want leaked out to the public, but somehow they did, and that could explain why we're seeing them eight months later. Once inside, you can see riot police dragging young men away. It's impossible for us to verify who these young men are or if indeed they're students. The security personnel end up in front of what appears to be the campus library and that's where things really get ugly. You can see security personnel kicking and hitting these young men as they literally put them in a pile. On several occasions you hear someone shouting, don't hit them, don't hit them. Again, not clear who that voice is. Towards the end of the clip, we see security personnel taking pictures of these young men and the video comes to an end. Now, the Iranian government has repeatedly denied that security personnel have gone on to the campus of Tehran University without a warrant. But on a portion of the tape, you hear a voice say, Rajab Zadeh ordered this. Now, what's interesting is Azizullah Rajab Zadeh was the head of the police special forces when this video was shot. He eventually became Tehran's police chief, but according to state-run media last week, he retired. No word if his retirement had anything to do with the leak of this video. Reza Sayyid, CNN, Islamabad.